Here's Chateau Moulin de Lille, 2012, saint Estef. This is a small property in saint Estef, which of course we know is in the Omedoc, home to several classified chateaus. It's the northernmost region, Omedoc just north of Poyac. Lots of good gravelly soils and lots of good, <laughs> lots of good wine. So this is a, uh, a chateau that's been in the same family for five generations. Uh, I guess it's a brother and sister now running it. They have about 60 acres, so small. Really, relatively. Good gravelly soils, nice mature vines, about 30 year old vines. Um, they're growing uh, Cabernet Sauvignon, of course, Merlot, a little bit of Petit Verdot. This wine from 2012, and we're finding these 2012s are really drinking beautifully now. Um, you know, they, they've just kind of hit a peak. Somewhat lighter vintage, more Merlot, because the Merlot ripened up really beautifully before uh, there was some rain. And uh, so this one's 70% Merlot, 30% Cabernet Sauvignon. They age this in barrels um, for between 12 and 18 months. pretty. Lots of cassis on the nose. A little bit of um, sort of dried herbs on there too, like, uh, like a little hint of rosemary. I get a little bit of a sweet cherry note also in there. Now I'm getting a little bit of a sort of a smoky note, like a, like a cigar box, I guess. Anyway, it's, it's really nice, complex nose. Let's try it. Hmm. Yeah, so really soft, lush. The, the fruit really speaks on this wine. Very pretty. Cherries, black currants. You get that, those little seasonings. A little bit of those herbal notes. And then on the finish, I'm getting a little bit of that sort of a smoky, oaky note. But um, yeah, I mean, kind of really nice, classic Bordeaux, you know, forward style, that Merlot really speaking. This is a wine you can really pair up with a lot of different foods and uh, just enjoy over the next five years easily. Happy drinking.